What is your purpose? What are you living for? When Jesus came to earth, he clearly stated that he came to earth from heaven not to do his will, but the will of the one who sent him. This account is recorded for us in John 6, 38, as I read from the New King James Version. It says this, For I have come down from heaven, not to do my own will, but the will of him who sent me. Amen. With such bold declaration, it was impossible at the time for Jesus to get into relationship with anyone and not know his purpose. He clearly stated it from the beginning. He led by example. He set a relationship standard for us to emulate. Amen. Brethren, you might say, I do not know what my purpose is. So how do I even communicate that in my relationships? I'll encourage you to begin by doing the will of your Heavenly Father, not your will. That is a very good place to start. His word is his will for you. You know, our goal is to highlight the significance of understanding yourself to an extent that you become an asset in your relationships. And the kingdom approach is this, purpose to do only the will of the Father in all relationships. You will not go wrong. Remember, you are the light of the world. So let your light shine before people with whom you relate by living a life, a purpose-driven life. Amen.